Hello guys, this is Razor Knight here, and today I'm going to give you my first act real actual tutorial ever. Today is going to be a tutorial on MC Edit, so uh, look forward to that. Let's go ahead and get on with the tutorial. The link will be somewhere in the description, so click on it and download it. And today I'm going to do a quick little tutorial for you guys. Okay guys, and welcome to MC Edit. I hope this is recording just fine. I've never tested fraps on this program just yet. So, uh, here you have your MC Edit Alpha 64-bit version. I uh, downloaded whatever bit you needed, uh, 32 or 64. And as you can see, uh, World 1, 2, 3, 4, they're all blank. You actually have to go and open the level for the new beta. The old Alpha worlds, you wouldn't have to. So, let's go ahead and open one. Uh, right now, I'm already at Glacier, uh, but it starts you somewhere around your saves. So you want to pick your saves. Glacier level that is the one I want to open. Actually, I didn't want to open up that one, to be honest. So let's go ahead and show you how to uh, get out of the program. Control gives you all your options. So you want to hit Control, that gives you your options. Then you want to hit Control N for New World, Open World everything else pretty simple self-explanatory stuff so we want to open another world why am I already at Glacier I'm pretty sure I created a new world that's this one right here that confused me MC edit is what I named it this is actually a Minecraft save so here we are uh, right click your mouse and that allows you to move the camera around and uh, the W it's like moving in Minecraft uh, hold the right mouse down and uh, Everything else is like moving in uh, Minecraft. I think it's W A S for back and D for right. Yeah, the right, the standard keys is what they are. And uh, with MC Edit, you can pretty much do anything you want. Let's see, what should I do? Just to, ooh, what the hell's over here? Oh, I thought it was a huge sand thing. I'm like what the hell? Okay, yeah, let's go ahead and level off a piece of ground. Um, Leveling off ground is good for building new stuff, especially quickly with uh, MC Edit. So what you want to do is you want to pick a corner, uh, actually click anything, and that that used to allow you. You used to be able to extend the the new update. I can no longer do it. I guess you used to be able to extend the block, but now you have to click to extend the block. And as you can see how it works, uh, wherever I last started is where it's gonna go see now I'm gonna create a new block somewhere and I'm gonna extend it from there as well so I wanna extend from here we're good to go just leveling off a piece of ground here you wanna go to the highest point and make your box wait no you get it that's not what I wanted let's go to a low point somewhere let's go on the other side of this hill and uh, I'm not sure, see it used to drag the box along with me so I'm not sure how low I need to go that was a fail, I think I double clicked oh man, here I'm giving a tutorial on a thing I don't even know how to work actually I do, I just keep screwing up there's a nice big box now uh you can delete blocks you can select all the chunks in that area which is going to extend it a little bit but right now I'm just going to delete block well, nah. delete blocks if you select a chunk it goes all the way to the top and all the way to the bottom so here we have a nice flattened piece of land now what should I do with this nice flattened piece of land well, the first thing I would have to do is level it all out. So I'd want to select that block there. And go all the way to the corner over here. And it's a lot like cuboid if you've ever used that. Select this block here. And you want to fill. And you can choose whatever material you want. Um, let's go ahead and fill a stone fill and now we have a nice flat piece of land and you can build anything you want on it 
What should I build? Let's go ahead and go into the game. Uh, we're going to go into the game, build something, and I'm going to show you how to copy and paste, really. Let's go ahead and move our character here. You can move your player. Let's move it here. Let's move the spawn point here in case I die. And we're good to go. Alright, now I need to open up some Minecraft. You want to close this first? Ooh. Ooh, 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 I forgot to save. It's one thing you need to do. Remember to save. So now I guess we're going back into MC Edit. And uh, I'm going to show you how to copy and paste without having actually anything built yet. That's, we can skip that. That's not, not a big deal. Where's MC Edit? I just had you. I gotta go to my desktop, I think, for it now. I need to put it in the start menu. I keep forgetting to do that. Okay. Now we're, we're back into MC Edit. Let's go ahead and open up Level That. This should still be on the, yep, yes it is, on the same map. And I forgot to save that Level It Out area, but that's okay. Let's find a good chunk to copy and paste. Here we go. Select one block, and I want to select all the chunks in that range. Now I have an entire chunk selected from top to bottom. Now I can clone a chunk. And I can paste it wherever the hell I want. See? There we go. Now, uh, you guys want to see how I, eh, we'll save that for another tutorial. I will show you how I built TNT Desert, and I'm going to build a new episode to go along with it. So it'll have a tutorial, and the TNT Desert, except for it won't be a desert this time, it'll be something else. I want to surround it in water, make it look really cool. So next time, I'll be giving you a tutorial and a new uh, big video coming up with a nice explosion, hopefully. So until then, have a nice day.